Hello, hello and welcome. Jilly Cube on a lovely Sunday afternoon. It's really lovely sun shining here in Queensland, Australia. I've had a little dip in the pool, which was lovely after I did my housework, had a bit of lunch and now I'm out in my art room enjoying my time. And there's nothing I love better. I'm gonna start off with a basic little flip cup on this 20 by 25 canvas, just because I've got some colors left over that I need to use up. Well, I don't need to use them up, but I would like to use them up before I uh, set on my next project. So I'm gonna do a basic, a dirty cup pour, and that's loading my paints, which are quite thick. So I hope this works out. That is a wicker yellow, or wicker it's called. Um, I'm going to use some of my uh, beautiful dark sea, which is one of my favorites. I have many. <laughs> and I'm going to put in some, this was one of my custom colors, which was silver with the dark sea in it. And that's absolutely gorgeous. So that's really, uh, yeah, metallic silver with the dark sea in it. And then there's the cool red. And then I'll go some white. And I will go to, I've got a bit of um, purple here. So I might as well put all these lovely colours in it. I'll go back now to the wicker. So just layering them in nice and just nice and relaxed. Enjoy your time. Back to the cool red. And my gorgeous custom colour, which I'm calling Mermaid, because it's such a beautiful, shimmery, shimmery blue. Um, I think I will add some white. Or white. And go back to this purple. And I think that should just about do it for sure. So there you go, those lovely colours. I'm gonna <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I'm gonna flip it just like that. Can allow all the colours to go down. Uh, Izzy Wizzy, let's get busy. Um, hopefully it's a lovely, lovely, I'm wondering if, no, I won't. I was going to pour some white around it, but I think, I think there's more than enough paint in there. So I will just let it out, burp it out. Wow. Lip it through with the lip of the cup. Oh, look at those colours absolutely shimmering oh my goodness look at this <coughs> cells there oh i don't want to lose too much of it so just gently tilt <coughs> this is a very basic style well, i think <coughs> i think this was one of the first techniques i did oh i've got a dry throat i need a uh, get myself a drink Oh, look at those colours there. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. That mermaid, that colour here that I've custom made, that is gorgeous. And it's so beautiful with the purple as well. Oh, uh, just tilt it all back to recenter it. Not liking that blob of white, but hopefully something interesting might come out of that area in a little minute but that is gorgeous I'm gonna hit that with my heat gun it just gets rid of any air bubbles in there and if you want cells it helps bring cells up I don't like that white area but you can always fix you can always fiddle and fix but that is gorgeous basic Flip cup pour, great for beginners, but very effective. Because I think when you see something like this and you're a beginner, you think, oh my goodness, I can do this. 
I've got some lovely cells inside my cup. I'm thinking that maybe I should put this, a ribbon of these colours left through that white might do nicely. And a ribbon through here. It's just the colours left in the bottom of my cup. And it kind of gives it a 3D effect. It's like the behind it's, um, all these ribbons are just floating. Beautiful, actually. I like it. I like it. Oh, now the cells are really popping up sort of weird. <laughs> I will bring you down to have a closer look. That's very lovely. Oh my goodness, some really strange creatures are starting to show up. There's like some caterpillars in there. There's eyes everywhere looking at me. There's like a spine, little grubs. And look at that shape inside the cells. They're really gone a bit weird. It must be because I've had this paint sitting here a little while um really looks in very interesting it's like something that you would probably see underneath the microscope <laughs> and those ribbon pores that i've poured through they're uh, kind of make it look a bit interesting but now these cells are all popping up well, that was a nice, easy one to do at home. Have it, do it with your girlfriend or your children or just do it because you can. It's uh, a lovely, lovely pastime. So my lovelies, thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't done so, please subscribe. Hit the subscription button. It's absolutely free and um, it costs you nothing and it helps me. So until tomorrow, please join me for something new. Bye for now.